Let it be. Psst. Oh, look at that. Sophisticated as ever. Black screen. <laughs> Black screen. <laughs> Wait one second, people. Wait one second. It's coming. The game's loading. The game's loading. It's a black screen. How's everyone doing while we wait for the black screen to disappear? The game is <laughs> the game is loading, guys. The game is sat on the loading screen. Uh, do I have something? There, we can put that up while we wait for the game to load. I think the game's now loaded. <laughs> the game's now loaded. Has the game now loaded? There we go. How is everyone doing? Sophisticated as ever. Slick and professional. How is everyone doing? Hey, where's... Hey, Lisa. Oh, Lisa's got a new profile picture. Hey, Nadine. Hey, Lindsay. Hey, Dennis. Hey, Robert. How you doing? How's everyone doing, peeps? Nice and warm today. It's been horrible weather here. It was lovely weather yesterday. But it's been garbage today. It's gone back to being garbagey weather. Freezing cold and raining all day. Yesterday was like, oh, is spring? Is it springtime? Do we hear the spring lambs? And then today it's just been, yeah, back to back to rubbish. Absolute garbage. Um, right, let me just double check. Let me just check to see I've got music and stuff playing. Because sometimes it doesn't like to play the music. Music is playing. Music is playing and it seems to be playing quietly, which is fine. <laughs> it's all it's all good in the hood. But the YouTube stream is about to get an overhaul to bring it slightly more in line with the Twitch stream. So same here, spring has disappeared. I know, 72 degrees here today. Snow next week. <laughs> exactly. I was better before you showed me what was inside your brain. What that black that is just a vacuum of space, an empty vacuum of space with a there should be like a little if you were to represent my brain in visuals, it would be mostly a black screen. Uh, but then there'd be, you know, when you get one of those little loading bars that says a time, it says a time, but you're never quite sure whether it's the real time. And then sometimes it goes from like 10 minutes to two hours. That's pretty much my brain. That's an image of my brain. Uh, right, I think I've done everything. I think I've done everything I'm supposed to do. Oh, there is one more thing I'm supposed to do. Hold on. Hold on. Right, I've got to make sure. So, so music and everything should be fine, right, guys? I'm assuming the music is playing, or if it's not playing, it's not obnoxiously loud and everyone's happy. We do see the result. That's what I'm. That is what I'm. I'm on my way to find. I'm. I'm clicking around outside the screen in order to find it. Uh. Because, yes, we have the results. We'll start off the results of the results of the Retro House competition. I'm speaking away from the microphone for a minute. One second. Um, what was it in the house over chat? There we go. So we'll put, I'll put this on screen for a minute. I think we had like, last time I looked, we had 28, 28 votes. Um, so here is the big here is the big reveal um oh it's 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 the it's it ended up being pretty close 26 votes sorry i miscounted it ended up being pretty close between 70s and 60s only two votes in that that's pretty cool though so 70s one so lisa's team lisa and Lisa and Lyserg. Very, very well done, peeps. Uh, you get you get first prize. <laughs> first prize. We might do um We might do a little might just do a little like thing in You can't read it. Did you not be could you not read that? You should have been able to read that. Maybe if you're squinting at a phone, you couldn't read it. It was eight. It was eight votes for for team seventies and six votes for team sixties, and the rest of us just don't even don't even ask. We're just embarrassed and ashamed of ourselves. 
frankly, frankly appalling performances from all. <laughs> no, everybody did really, everybody did really well. Everybody did really well. Um, so yeah, we'll probably I'll probably have what is going on with this? Like, why does this keep happening? I am slightly concerned that we've. You're on one four four p. Yikes! How come? Why does this keep happening in this house? I have to take all the wall out just to put it back up again. I guess I could maybe if I painted it, it would fix. This would be interesting to see. So yeah, we'll probably have a little thing on the Discord, which is just like a little champion slot or something. <laughs> Team community champions or something temporarily but yeah very well done it was um as i said i'm probably i probably am gonna put a little oh, are you kidding i'm gonna put a little video out of it uh hopefully in the next in the next um, imminent amount of time prize giving is uh yeah the the prize giving is prestige and kudos in abundance <laughs> you get you get that that's your prize it's like the bbc we're not allowed to give out prizes <laughs> we're not actually allowed to give out prizes are just a thing it's just for funsies it was just for funsies but yeah i'll do a little um i think i'll just do like a little showcase type deal type video oh what this is ridiculous has anyone else had this problem with this house is it just me Let's see if i can paint you get a dog i'll post you a dog there won't be much of a dog left by the time i've posted you a dog but I'm not quite sure getting a dead dog in the post is quite as <laughs> it's quite as nice as getting a real dog. Um, where's the where's the friggin paint, man? Do, 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 do. Not seen this problem before. I'm wondering if it's because I put the because I've blocked the door. Oh, it's fixing it if I paint it. Okay, that's all right then. I'm not fussed then. So I blocked in the other side, didn't I? I decided I didn't want the other side. Okay, so we're going to make the... Oh, you. You. What are you? remove the exterior wall I don't know what to do about this let's just remove this one. Oh my gosh oh that is actually what is what is going on there I, I would suspect it's something glitchy because I've removed that because I've covered up the roof up there Let's just get rid of all this. This is jank. I don't I don't really care as long as it just disappears. Don't build wall in that house because it look at the save file. I think it'll be fine. We'll just we'll just paint over it and uh, and hope that them being painted means that they don't have the same janky problem. So we're going to do this is going to be um as I said this is going to be basically a proper bunker. Uh as soon as this is actually my first bunker, I 
I think I might move that door there. It makes it a bit more practical, doesn't it? So I'm not I'm not technically moving the walls, I'm just removing moving the door, which is in the is in line with the the rules. Yeah, so I think we'll just make it we'll make it kind of as bunkery as we can. Um, what I was thinking was maybe something like you know the sliders on the on the like you know the old sort of 1950s style bunkers that had almost like a tanking so that the whole of the bottom of the wall is like tanked uh, so it's waterproof that was kind of my picture in my head uh, so we try and make it look kind of as authentic -y kind of almost like fallout sort of style like a proper bunker and not just like a room because at the moment the moment my th my problem with these bunkers has always been they basically just look like rooms don't they they're not they're not really bunkers they're just they're not they're not really they're not really either bunkers or basements because uh, they have this really silly door but then they basically just have exactly the same walls like these should be like prefab walls and not have doors and things doesn't seem like it makes a lot of sense they're not bunkers in the sense that you'd see in a house are they like they're bunkers as in you'd see in like a nuclear this is more like a facility but it's it's not like a it's not like someone would have as a bunker um right so let's try let's see if i can kind of get you guys to understand what my brain is thinking um so what are the sliders called again are they actually called sliders yeah, but it's not. Well, that's the thing, Wes. That's what I'm saying. It's it's kind of not really a basement either, because you obviously wouldn't have a ladder into a basement. You'd have a basement. You'd have a set of stairs down into it. I mean, a set of stairs down to it would be way more practical from the house. This is a bunker, but it's not really been it's not really been treated like a bunker. For it to be a bunker, actually, do you know what? Hmm. You know the curved wall pieces, the arches and stuff. This might help. Arch. Let's just have a look at this a second. I wonder if I did that everywhere. They can't be painted though. That's the only problem. I want it to feel like a proper bunker, like a Hey awesome beard man, how you doing? Yeah, I play I basically play this game every week, once a week, <laughs> every week. So there's always a bit of me that that kind of has to remember everything. But yeah, we 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 stream this once a week every week yeah that doesn't really show much though does it so do you, you kind of get what i mean like it's um so it feels like it's made out of like, what i yeah what i'm going for is i want this to look like it's made out of metal that's what i'm shooting for i want it to look like a metal underground structure not something made out of plaster not a basement because it's not really a basement because it'd have to have a set of stairs i think that will i think that will add something just that little curvy bit i don't think this is what this is for but we'll use it for that an anderson shelter that's it yeah much more like a 
a traditional kind of old style shelter. Uh, well, Dennis is the one that's made Dennis Gaming in now in the chat here is the one that's made those ceiling tiles. So, Dennis, is there anything? <laughs> is there a is there a green one? I mean, it would be cool if there was a green one of these, wouldn't it? But there there isn't. So, if we did, um, if we did this on the doors as well. Those don't, those kind of don't snap. Interesting. Oh, there we go. I think this will help. We're going to have to, it's, it's going to be the, it's going to be the, like, the actual stuff on the walls that's going to make it. It's going to be the tricky part. We might not have any doors either. We shall see. Apart potentially from this one, which would be the storeroom. Uh, so let's have a look what we've got in terms of the sliders. That's what I need. Is the is the wall slider pieces? Um, where are they? Interior. They're in interior design, I think. I haven't really done any preparation for this idea, to be honest. It just kind of popped into my brain as we started doing it. Uh, but if there's some, if there's some cool, I know there's like, I know there is a bunch of sort of Fallout stuff on the workshop, which I don't know if I've got yet. Um, what was it I'm looking for? I'm looking for. I can't. I don't think they're called sliders now. I think the person changed them to something else. Do, 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 do. Scrolling forever. Old trusty ball pen hammer. All of that. Is that going to take me all the way back to the beginning? No, it doesn't, does it? I have those as well. You're definitely going to want like boxes and and yeah, things like orange juice. Right, let's start putting this stuff in there. I haven't managed to get that door in the right place, but never mind. See, look, interesting, interesting, interesting. So this is what I said before. This is a this is a workshop item, and the peeps are recognising it as food. The buyers are recognising it. That's definitely an improvement from when they started the workshop. Um. Pantry shelves. Yeah, we want this. We'll just kind of shove some of this in as I'm going so I don't have to keep scrolling. There's a Fallout Nuke on the workshop. Is there? What does that look like? Is that any good? Maybe we'll do a little workshop browse in a minute once I've kind of got this idea going. Because I need some more workshop items, clearly. I don't have enough. Hey, Sousa. Thank you very much. Hi from Brazil. Epic. Hello from the UK. You're very welcome. In our little corner of the Tinterwebs. So we are making, we're making like a fallout shelter, basically. I'll I'll have a I'll probably have a look at that in a sec, Wes. We'll get there. Um Yeah, we've done a little work. We end up browsing the workshop quite often in the stream. Because it's quite handy, Robert, because you don't have to leave the game to add the items um from the workshop. So we've done it a few times where I've just kind of tabbed out. Um, and you guys can see me browsing the workshop and then the game just stays open and when you open back up the game it's got all the all the new things you've subscribed to which is pretty cool we'll do a bit of that and a bit of this but we'll just kind of collect some things as we scroll down 
I always do this and I always end up forgetting what I'm actually looking for. Uh, I'm looking for the sliders, aren't I? We want a bed that's kind of rickety looking as well. So in my head, the picture I have of this is a combination of stuff from films what's that one where they oh, what's that horrible film there's that horrible film with um with the bloke out of roseanne <laughs> who's that guy out of dan out of roseanne who is in a is in like a bunker and he's like a psycho i can't rem really remember the story this is poor this is a poor description hey frankie how you doing That's all right, dude. I, you know, it's probably not entirely you, Frankie. Last week, and I think the week before, I changed the schedule around. Uh, so yeah, it's not probably you. It's probably that I've changed it. Tuesdays. So Wednesdays has been the regular house super stream forever, and then last couple of weeks we've changed it to Tuesday. Uh, can make metal ceiling panels and brick arches. Uh, right, so I know I've just gone past these, but they're not quite what I want. Do, do, do. Yeah, I'm one of those random film moments again. What, so it's like a film. It's basically this great big massive bunker this guy lives in. And I can't remember how this young couple end up in this basement with him. And I vaguely remember there's something with like someone getting dissolved in a vat of acid or something pleasant like that. These might be useful to us. John Goodman, that's it. John Goodman is Dan out of Roseanne, isn't he? And was in like that Blues Brothers yeah any <laughs> i don't know what it's called so it's this is it it's that that i'm using as my reference in my brain these might be these might be useful yeah lovely film one of those sorts of kids films yeah and there was that one with that woman that got that true story of that woman that got locked in a bunker oh this isn't gonna work that might work though. Cloverfield Lane. Well done, Lindsay. Yeah. And the other one was Room, I think. Yeah, so that might help. Add some detail. So those are my... Yeah, the Room was the one with the woman who ended up being Captain Marvel. Or whatever her name was. Where did where did all my sliders go? Are, they, are you telling me they're not actually in here? oh they're in this one look if i just looked if i'd use my eyes right so what we need is yeah like a dark green this could work that could work ceiling tiles i think are going to be a struggle unless there are dark green ceiling tiles Hey, Mama Bear, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Um, under window. Yeah, so this is a little bit too green. We'll have a little look on the workshop in a second, but this could work. We'll just do a little kind of, so we get a little feeler for what this could look like. Just do many toves. Okay. And then the floor would need to be different as well. Uh, and it would need... It would need some moulding. Um, so we'll do a bit of that just to get it. Just to show what I'm thinking. See if this can work. Um, Murnum, maybe. Nice if that was green. I 
I can't place that over the top of that. Oh, I can't put it at the top, can I? Because it's got a it's got that weird hitbox to it. Hmm. But yeah, we'll have a little. I think we'll end up with a little look on the workshop in a second. So I can do that. What I really need is something vertical, like vertical pieces. I can't use that now because I've used those curves. Oh, don't put me up the ladder. And then what would we do actually with the colour of the walls? I mean, I guess I could just make the whole, I could make it a whole slider. Let's see how the slider interacts with that curve bit on the top there. Um, it's that one, isn't it? That one. Do, 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 do. Uh, full wall. I so see that actually would work out all right. So we might be we might be better off going with full green. Hey elephant puppet, how you doing? We are we're trying to make a like um a shelter, like a well we're trying to make a bunker a proper bunker. So we've put this curved piece. Um what did you call it, Lisa? An and was it an Anderson shelter or something like that? Like a an actual like proper bunker. Oh, can I not get rid of those now? Crap. Oh, I can. It's all right. Stop grabbing me ladder. Do, 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 do. Okay, right. So let's have a little look on the workshop, see what we can see. Um, did I actually get any... Any like fallout stuff from any of you guys? Anderson shelter. Okay, let's have a little let's have a little look look see on the workshop a second. Yeah, dark grey. Hmm, dark grey with green over like underneath it could work, couldn't it? Let's have a little look. What we'll do is we'll set up we'll set up a little strip, two little strips, we'll set a little strip up over here as well. And then we can decide which one's gonna work better. Because we're gonna have it everywhere, so it's gonna need to be right. So that's it full. Couldn't find anything. I'll have a I'll have a little look see. Um yeah, and then we'll go with Yeah, maybe like a the the grey the greyest of greys. Let's see what this looks like. It's all right, but it's all a little bit too matte, isn't it? That's the it's it's too much of a sort of matte finish. Let's get the light on as well in here. What we want is like a, yeah, that slightly glossier finish. Or as near as we can get to it. Um, stick a light in for a second. See, I think as well by doing stuff that's like the lights are quite low, that might help as well. Let's just grab this. search bunker I think I've got some stuff in that I've already got from you guys that would work down here as well okay let's go let's jump over to the workshop then in a second um, right 
right so let's do this then Ooh, new things new things yeah we're gonna we're gonna try we're gonna experiment with both dennis for a minute and see that's what i was looking for lisa uh, for lindsay uh f o fallout 4 See, I think we'll grab that at least. And this maybe? What's this then? Blue rug. Let's get a few of these bits going. Um, washer I've already got, I think. Let's get, we've got that as well. There's nothing quite... There's nothing quite that I'm looking for. Oh, that's better though. I definitely want those. What's that? Suit package. Oh, I'm terrible when it comes to these. I'm really terrible when it comes to the workshop because I'm always just like, yep, all of the things. All of the things, thank you. Give me all of them. Here we go. Look, metallic blue. Is there a green? Oh, tell me you've done a green. Let's have a look at this dude. Oh my days. Or oh, this lady. I mean, they've done some amazing stuff, haven't they? Look at these. Transparent blue slider. I haven't looked at half of these. I wonder if they've done anything that isn't a colour that's in the game. That's what we're kind of looking for. That's cool as well. We're not going to go through every 68 pages. This is the problem because they end up with like... What's this? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I should be in this person's workshop because I'm going to go everywhere now. Oak wall cap, parquet floor, yes please. Well, we could get, what's that? Place halogen lights inside to light up. What? Oh, it's not working. Proof of concept, but if it works. <laughs> oh, it's not what I think it is. It's like a... That's kind of cool though, quite like that. Yeah, it's pretty nuts, isn't it? How many, how many like good things there are. All right, we'll get, we'll get to that. We'll get to that in a sec. I just want to, I want to make sure I've got some of this stuff. You have to put spotlights inside it. Green, brown, off-white slider. What's this? This looks promising. Green, brown, off-white slider, slap B. It's a little bit difficult to tell. That's the only thing I would say. Requested color scheme slider slap. What, what, what color is it though? Is it all of those colors or is it one of those colors? They're really small. It's a little bit difficult to tell what these things are. That's my only complaint. Fine wood shelf, 1.2. Slider slats. I'm going to grab one of these just so I can see what it is because it may be something that we find useful anyway. It's all the different colours. Okay. Fine wood shelf, moulded edges. Let's get that as well. <laughs> Let's get all of the things. But they're really small. So they have made some sliders that are, yeah, like wallpapers, aren't they? Well, anything that says a slider is, is thin, but that's what we want. 
what's that one metallic metallic pink all right i'm gonna search for metallic then inside this person's thing can i do that um unless they say full wall half wall etc yeah can I not search inside someone's stuff? That seems a bit dumb. All oh, right, they have got a collection though. Oh. Sliders, squares and lines. I could just subscribe to all of these in one foul click and then not be able to get back into my game. This is an easier way of looking at them though. Dark olive green texture. That's got potential, isn't it? You're all right. You're in the right place, Mama Bear. <laughs> <laughs> There's some sliders in dark green as crackers used them in. Is, is that not just the one I had, the forest green one? But look at the textures of these. These are these are perfect, like rusty looking. See how that looks like it's I'm gonna get these. I'm not sure if these are the right things. But they are they look like they're tiles and not sliders. See how that looks like it's sort of corroded. I'm just gonna get all of them. See what they look like. Hey Jens, how you doing? Or Sub Zero? Welcome, welcome. You've come in as we're just kind of browsing through some some workshop stuff. So is there not one of these that's like uh, what I want is this texture, but as like a full wall piece, like a whole dealy. Maybe I'm not in the right thing. I can't understand how you can't search within someone's stuff. Furniture types. I mean, I guess I could go back to the workshop and just type full, like full wall. We could try that, can't we? Oh my days. Tedium. That was flipper. No. Okay, let's go let's go back. Textured plaster walls. Okay, we'll try that. They got some awesome stuff though. I should probably follow this person, shouldn't I? Okay, so textured plaster walls. I don't know if that's a, that was a search. Textured plaster oh these are by someone else are they these are the architect oh this seems promising dark green textured okay maybe this is what i want does that look right hmm. let's get them anyway let's get them anyway have it all get all of the things why wouldn't you not i don't have to do this why am i clicking in and out let's do that this i do get worried that at some point my game is just going to be like nope too many things you can't have all of the things is that any good to us probably not Yeah, this is what I want. It's these, but I want them larger. So that is fifth. Those are fifteen. They still might be useful though, because they look like they're rusty. If you see what I mean. We'll get back to the game in a second. Sorry, peeps. I'm browsing. I do apologise. <laughs> I do apologise. But there's so many epic things on the workshop now. But it does, it's like a little, I think the Dean said a few times, it's like opening the Christmas presents. <laughs> you look onto the, uh, the stucco ones are 
a full wall. Okay, well we'll try we'll try just an, an FW search there and see if that gives us anything. I think we would already have seen them though if if um she'd done those textures for everything. Hey Agent M, thank you very much for this the tip, dude. It would be wonderful if I, if it had subtitles in the video. I don't understand everything. I'm very, very sorry. <laughs> I'm very sorry. I probably speak a bit quick as well. Um. Oh, hang on. What were they? I don't actually know if that overlay will appear. You, you've tipped at the... Uh, well, apologies, but you just didn't see the alert pop up for that, Agent M, because we were in the workshop screen for a sec. But yeah, as I said, very much appreciated, buddy. We are we are fully embracing the. You'll be pleased to know we are fully embracing the, uh, the shelter, the basement thing. So we're going for a. It's kind of a fallout shelter. I'm going to get them as well. That could potentially work. Hey Micah, how you doing? And brother Jonah, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Right, I'm I'm nearly done. Uh, and then we'll do a little, we'll do a search for anybody got any other suggestions for what else we could search for. That might work down here. What was the search? What was the was it a nuke that then, Wes? Was your what was your search that you ended up with a nuke? You speak Portuguese, so usually on the videos, I don't know how if it works on the live streams, but um, you can usually switch on subtitles. So that that should work, but. Old bunker, yes. Sorry, you're right. And then we'll go back. Bunker. Oh, this one. Yeah, that's cool, isn't it? And that one, but I don't think I want that one. Okay, right. We're done. We're done. We're done. No more. No more getting things, Toves. <laughs> Shelter. Oh no. <laughs> one more look. One more look. Promise. No more looking after this. This is the last time. Shelter. It wasn't shelter. Shelter's not working for me as a search. No, I can't. It's not. It's not a thing. No more. <laughs> no more. Right, let's see if we've got anything of any use in the last 10 minutes. Um, where are they all going to be? Are they going to be in... They're going to be in renovation, I guess. Oh my... I feel like my menu is already slower, look. Right. What I'm really interested in... Is this. These... These... Can you make these work? Oh, we can make these work. I think... I think we can make these work. I think it... Because this is too, like... It's too glossy. It just looks like paint, doesn't it? So that was a 15 centimeter one. Presumably you can just fill a whole wall. This is going to be nuts though, isn't it? If anyone wants to look while I'm streaming, just to make sure that there isn't a full a full wall slider of that. Because that is absolutely perfect. In fact, maybe even combine it with a, with a, a brown one. Or maybe just have a brown one. 
it's that rusty texture that I want. See how it looks like it's rusty. So that's the lighter one. And what was this? Okay, that goes that way. Try the one by one. The one by ones, yeah. Is that doesn't make a lot of difference, I think. It does look a bit like soil and grass in Minecraft, doesn't it? Um, okay, let's just have a little check on any of the other stuff that we got there. So dark green slider, full wall. Oh, that's it. That's better, isn't it? It's not quite it's not quite as convincing. Hmm, I don't know. What do we think? It's a better colour, that's for sure. But it does look like stucco. That looks more like stucco than this does. Yeah, it's different though. It's definitely different because you can see the texture's different. I'm tempted to go with just this brown everywhere. Let's see what else we've got. This would this could be another option as well. Mm, that looks more like cladding though, doesn't it? That looks more like wooden cladding than actually a uh, See, that would be perfect if that was in a green. Okay, what about this as a combo? It's going to look weird, but let's just do this for a second. So we'll put the blue stuff along the bottom. In fact, is that a, that's, a, that's a darker one. That might be better. That could work. <laughs> we're, we're, we're spitballing here, guys. <laughs> we're spitballing ideas. We're flying the ideas around. Um, did I get anything else that's of use? No. So that, and then where's my my cool one? This on top of it. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I think that could work with a bit of moulding between the two. Dun -dun. Um, it's a shame I can't get these in a, in a good colour. It's a little bit difficult to imagine right now, but ev if you imagine it everywhere and all the way up the walls and then it goes up to a curve so there'd be another curve point piece over here in fact there shouldn't be a curve piece there yeah i think we'll give that a go i think we'll give that a try i think that could work Yeah, these are these are cool, but they're they're definitely much more like a that's like a stucco, isn't it? That's not what I'm. That's not what I want. Uh, so those are going. The only problem about using these sliders sometimes is that you have to get them. They have to kind of fit. This is going to be a lot of placing, isn't it? This is going to be a million clicks to get this done. Uh, so oh, it's a shame there's not a blue version of that. Hey, perfect. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I think that I think that could work. I think that can work. Let's do it. So we're using this everywhere. That's the right one, isn't it? Can I place that over the top of the molding? Probably not. Can sweet. 
what would be really useful was if there were just some like real sort of just normal looking like bits of wood and stuff <laughs> just is that a slider that is a slider isn't it i need to get rid of it uh yeah just some so i kind of want some some like thinner bits of molding sometimes that are just like wooden colored and not and not not these things that we've got oh these are gonna jitter that they've got like a z fight thing going down so this one this is going to be one of those things that isn't going to really make it's not going to look right until it's at least one room done we're going to have to think about the floor options in here as well what would be preferable would be a floor that matches to this to this uh cladding stuff did we work out we can't get rid of these as well yeah we did annoying get rid of that as well so i think we're gonna have like this is just gonna be like an entrance room with maybe some sort of power thing or something here like one of the generators maybe a little storage and, and whatnot um and then we'll have like a main how many rooms have we got actually we've got four rooms so i guess this should be like a bathroom at the back bedroom it's tiny isn't it little living room the wood pan at the bottom are in bottom are in wood white cream light blue dark blue black pale pink and medium blue yeah that's a shame you mean this piece that i'm using here because if it was in green that would be perfect i think this blue is all right though it i mean it really it's just that little it's the it's the it's that it's the sort of tongue is i mean i think it's supposed to be like tongue groove here or something isn't it but i'm i'm sort of trying to make it look like it's uh like corrugated basically there's a there's a dark red sandstone slider that looks like stone yeah that one okay I'm trying to make it look like it's kind of corrugated metal. I'm going to come back to that in a sec. If maybe not even corrugated metal, but like I think maybe they're plasticky. Maybe it's like a plastic actually. I never noticed that. That's got like a gloss finish to it as well. So these if we use these rounded edges hmm. if we do use the rounded arches it might be a bit it's going to be a problem isn't it because i can't paint that all right we'll get to that in a sec um okay so floor options oh and well, in fact we'll, we'll carry on with this for a while <laughs> do this for a bit uh and i think maybe a couple of these sort of posts these vertical posts here and there might help to sell it a little bit as well that works quite nicely doesn't it mm. i don't want i don't want it overlapping because it's gonna z fight is it gonna work into the corner over here that's gonna be the question it's not okay what if we take that down I 
It looks good anyway. I like whatever you're doing. It looks good. It look, always looks great. Thank you very much, Mama Bear. Appreciate it. Thanks for your suggestions. Right. A million clicks. This may well <laughs> this may well come a little this may become a little laggy. It does it I don't know if you guys think that, that I'm going mad here, but that looks like rusty metal to me. It looks like it's slightly corroded metal. I can see how that could be seen as dirt as well, but I think it looks like it's kind of rusty metal. The trouble is, once I've done this, what am I going to do with the next bunker? <laughs> the next bunker is just going to be, a, I might just ignore and not do. I'm happy that it's going to get nice and dark down here as well. Because I really, I think that adding a bunch of these, I think it works great. So it's a nice one. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I can't add these everywhere I want to add them. Interesting. I wonder if you can actually use the ceiling tiles down here as well. Oh, the others are bigger, are they? No, right, okay, cool. Yeah, this one is this one is a little squeeze. But this was kind of the idea of that was why I didn't want it accessible from the house, because I wanted it to feel like it was outside in the garden, basically. Stop. Okay, keep getting stuck on the ladder. Is that no? It is getting it's getting jittery. It's a shame you can't rot. Oh, have I overlapped that then? Have I? Yeah, I think I did. It's a shame you can't rotate these. But actually, they do mesh together. I mean, it's a repetitive pattern. Obviously, you can see that it's repeating, but it's not too bad. You can place the ceiling tiles down here. Then cool. I'm assuming there's not going to be a ceiling tile that's going to match <laughs> this though. What can we do with the ceiling tile? We might just have to... It just looks like concrete though, doesn't it? It's not what I want. What do you guys think would work for a ceiling tile in here? It's just going to be a lot of clicking. This bugger. <laughs> I mean, we're otherwise done with the house. It's just the bunker to do. Yeah, I think this this is going to look cool. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm thinking just black. Mirrored would be too much. I think. Dun, dun, dun. I'm thinking just black and then maybe a, a, a black floor as well. Or well, actually that tip, one of those timbers, I think one of those timber things was a tile. A floor tile. One of those little cladding pieces could work. Sorry, those um, like parquet pieces could work. Oh, you can't move a light. Interesting. A light switch. Toilet in the roof. Madness. Madness, I tell you. In fact, actually, we could make that the oh, stupid ladder. We could make this the toilet, couldn't we?
Yeah, true, because I'm not going to be able to paint that, am I? Oh, my lips are tripping over everything here. It's too tight. Asbestos should be in the ceiling tiles, yeah. Does it let you do this behind the ladder? Oh, I was worried there for a second. Many moments later. Uh oh. No game. No game. No game. Why'd you do it to me? Oh, you're such a rectum. Why'd you do it to me, game? <sighs> yeah, well, I didn't really think about it, but yeah, it would make sense for that to be a bathroom, I think. I can't do any of that stuff, Dennis. <laughs> I wish I could, dude, but I can't. I don't have the skills or the time. Uh, what's the chances that one of these will squeeze in there as well? No. Hey, Razzle, how you doing? Oh. I don't, I don't, Frankie, do I? What is that about, man? Like, what? why don't I just make it easy? <laughs> I just do the simple things. <laughs> well, Razzle, so we're making a bunker. We're making like an Anderson shelter down here. We found this cool, like, corroded metal tile thing. Hmm. Uh, and this, like, cladding stuff and things. I think it I think it's gonna work. Apart from that little we're just gonna ignore that little goober up there. We'll just ignore that. And now I think it's the I think it's the the collision with this thing. Stupidly. It wasn't a problem before. Oh yeah, they can overlap, yeah, so you might be right. Can I just have them like No, it's just not having it. Oh oh Okay, let's try this then. You did. It came in at the right time. What's that thing that Gandalf says? A wizard is never it. He arrives precisely when he means to. Something like that, anyway. Yeah, I can't I can't quite get it perfect. You reckon just overlap the smaller ones. I don't I I don't think it's gonna help because I can't get them I just can't get them there. See? I can get a bit more of that covered though, can't I? That's alright. We'll we'll paint that and it won't no one will notice it. No one will even know it was there, ever. Clearly you're not supposed to be doing this, are you? This is the game's not... I mean, it look, that can look like it's supposed to be there. Look, watch. Sift by magic. We'll paint that black. And it will look like it's part of the feature. It will look like it's a bit of the of the railing. Perfect. I'd buy that. Maybe even grey would be better. Still grey. Still grey's a bit light, isn't it? Let's actually go with grey, grey. Grey, grey. Yeah, that's better. He wouldn't even know it was supposed not he <laughs> wouldn't even know it was an accident. That's what I'll tell everybody anyway. Right, so let's finish this little bit off. We'll leave this wall for now. No one will know. 
exactly. Fix this. We'll finish this little bit off and then we'll look at the floor and then I won't do that other wall for a minute. So it doesn't drive us all mad. Yeah, the possibilities that these little sliders give you is pretty cool, isn't it? I think the thing is, this is what I like about the workshop items, that they just give you flexibility just to do things that they weren't even really planned for. Like this, I think Ozzo made these as part of his kitchen set. It does look like a nice day out there, doesn't it? Okay, so let's um let's have a look at the molding around here. And then we'll look at the floor. Floors. Okay, so the the wall molding piece, the Murnum is slightly narrower than the Creo, right? Yeah, that's what I want. The Murnum. And I want it in the dark grey, I guess. I think that's as good as we're going to get. Okay, so let's do our edge pieces. Um, I actually don't mind the dark grey. We might leave the dark grey as, a, as an, an addition, but we shall see. If it, oh, stupid bloody ladder. It might need the dark grey. We'll do it in the dark grey. Someone should make stains and dirt patches in the workshop. Yeah, that's a good shout. Like decals. That's a that's a cool idea, Frankie. Yeah. Or like. Um, you know what I was thinking about with the when we did the retro house as well I was looking at what would be cool is to have some way of having um, around the pools like splashes but just I mean it, that again could just be a decal so it just looks like a little bit of it is shiny or a little bit of it is dirty I, I guess the trouble is I don't know if you'd have to make that like a transparent thing I guess you probably would you just make it like a transparent thing and, and it just darkens slightly whatever you put it on or it, or it does something. That's a cool idea though. How's your blender skills? <laughs> you should get on that. I do wish I was, I wish I was kind of, um, well, for one thing, I don't really have the time to do it, to be honest. But I wish I, I wish I had the, the skill. Oh, this isn't going to work. Why is this not going to work? That's fine. Decals I have them in Sims Four. They can really scuff up a build. Yeah, I think I've seen like cracks and stuff that people have. I think I've seen. People have used cracks and things. Is that a decal? I have to type to not be so sus. I'm typing. I'm in typing class. <laughs> like how it's looking. Cool. Thanks, Wes. Don't tell anyone. Don't tell Wes's teacher. Not my, I'm not responsible for Wes's education here, Pete. Just so you know. Just so you know, it's not my fault. I'm discouraging you, Wes. Get back to your typing class. Oh! Right, okay. So, floor. What have we got options-wise for floor? So, I don't know if any of those are going to be right. What did I just grab? Can I... I can't put these on the floor, can I? 
and that. Oh, hold on a second. Can I put these on the floor? No, I can't. That would have been cool. Um, what did I just get? I just got some like parquet floor that could work. Something like that. I want something crappy looking. Oh, we could actually just go with a. We could actually just go with a concrete. Like a poured concrete. That we've got in the game. Fog glass block. What's this? Oh, that's what I used in the retro house. Okay. Um, black ceiling tile. That's for the ceiling, isn't it? Yeah, we're going to want the white ones. I don't know if I've actually even got the white ones, to be honest. Uh, let's use that as well. Oh no, not so much. You can't do that. Okay. Okay, right, so maybe just the concrete. Maybe just the ones out of the actual base game. Like this. Because this is suitably kind of scruffy looking. In fact, maybe that will look better. Let's have a look. Looks a bit light to me. It's coming though, isn't it? It's coming together. I think maybe the darker one. Do, do, do. Yeah, I think it's coming together. Okay, so let's see if we can. The problem we're going to have is the is this janky door. We can place over the panels. You're saying you can't place over the panels. The vent, I'm assuming you're talking about. Uh, let's have a look at ceiling tiles again. Ceiling. Yeah, I can't. I guess well, that's what you meant. Yeah, you can place some things over the, the over the ceiling panels, though. Uh, over the those panels. Because you can place pictures and stuff over the top of them. Is there bigger ones of these, Dennis? 20... One by one. Oh, that's better. It might just be the fact that it's because it's a mod, you can't place another mod on top of it. Oh, I can't kind of. Oh, I could pretend this is not even here. Can we literally. Oh, if I get stuck on this door all night, <laughs> I'm going to go mad. What happens if I cover this in? I hope I can remove these, Dennis. <laughs> we do. What happens if I what happens if I close this in here forever? We're stuck down here forever now, peeps. This is where I get my barrel of acid out. Do I just glitch through? Sweet! Yay! I don't even need to have the horrible door there. Perfect. Oh, can we get out? Yeah, we don't even have to have the horrible door visible. Sweet, I'm liking that. They overlap. Oh, brilliant. Perfect. I'm liking this, guys. I'm excited by this already. That's so much. These are so much better, Dennis. Why have I not been using these? <laughs> have I not been using these all the time? You little genius. I should have been using these constantly. Um, because they they're so much better white. They're not the horrible horrible grey. This looks cool. This looks cool. I'm liking this already. Okay, so our little first room. So should we? I'm kind of tempted to say we paint this grey. I tempt this one. I think we might paint grey. Um, I'm not going to buy another paint can because Lisa always tells me off when I do that. I've got another one here somewhere. There we go. So we'll make this. So maybe we'll just make this whole one side white. Um, this whole one side of it grey. 
And then the other walls will be in that rusty gubbins. Oh, that's not right, is it? That one I want. Yeah, I think this does make this makes more sense for this to be a toilet. Um, same as this is the, such a small room. So maybe it's toilet, storeroom, living space, bedroom. Kind of tempted to take the walls out. I'm, I mean, I'm, I might, I might let my rule slip a little bit on this one, guys, because. This is my first bunker, so I mean the idea of not removing the walls and things is to make things a little bit quicker, and also, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have this problem with this arch, aren't I? We'll see. We'll see when we get there. Yeah, storage in the, storage in this. I could do storage here, I guess. I was sorry to hear that, Micah. Look after yourself, dudes. Make sure you have plenty of uh, plenty of rest and fluids and all that sort of stuff that people say. If in doubt, get yourself some nice chocolate. That'll always help when you feel sick of me. It doesn't really, but makes you feel better. I didn't say that. No, no. Oh yes, I will need a kitchen. Well, a kitchen was going to be in the in the living room area. Yeah, that was going to be. Oh, is this not going to let me do this because of this stupid? Um, why is it suddenly? Why is it suddenly becoming a problem here then? Man and strip, one meter. It's because of the it's because of the hitbox on that thing. It's right at the very top of it, isn't it? So can I let's take them out for a minute. I might have to move the molded up slightly. I think we've had that before. Um innovation. Do, 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 do. What is this thing? Dark wool, dark wood wool slider. <laughs> it's the best type of sick. That's the best type of sick, Frankie. That's the not knowing when to stop type of sick. I do quite often get that as well. I don't think it makes any difference, Mama Bear. You can't place them down the wrong way. Like it won't let you place it that way. I'll tell you what it is. It's where the little it's the, where the hitbox of this is colliding with that. It's not gonna this isn't gonna make the slightest bit of difference what I've just done. It's just gotta go up. It's gotta go up there. That's alright. Hey Stephanie! Another person from Brazil all the Brazilians in tonight. Welcome, welcome. Oh no. Game. Don't do me like this. So that one will go down there. Oh, you swine. What's going on? Why? That one will go down there and it will go overlapping halfway, but it won't place up there. Are you kidding me, man? How can I, I can have it sticking out like that? That's... Um. I'm 
Gara for you. Let's try. Oh. We might have to put something here. That's fine. We'll put something there to hide that corner. We can make our way around that. <laughs> we can. Just in time for molding. Exactly, crackers. We're doing we're doing an Anderson shelter kind of thing in the I've been informed that's what they're called in my first bunker, bunkery bunker house. Old man's bunker. So this is supposed to be this is supposed to look like a rusty metal. That's what we're going for. It's going all right, yeah. I'm having fun with it so far. I'm going a bit mad with the old sliders and stuff and things. Oh, you got what? Game. Just put it where I want it. Let's not let's not have this. We don't have to do this today. <laughs> Behave yourself. Uh. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have a janky corner. I'm gonna have a janky corner. We're gonna have to hide the janky corner. Oh, I don't think I can have it. I can't have it half. So like Fallout, Fallout Four kind of thing, basically. So like it's it's either curved. So we've got like a curved thing, and it's I'm in a I'm in a metal box, basically. That's what we're going for, rather than it looking like it's a plastered thing. So this is supposed to look like rusty metal, and this is supposed to look like corrugated metal at the bottom like a 60s kind of deal that sort of dealio so I can't can't place that because of this again this little stupid bit on the ladder uh, so we could what we could do is just accept the fact that it's going to be jank in that corner if I put something there it won't you won't see it no one will see it we'll all just pretend it didn't happen oh you're a pain in them why are you not why just why How are you doing, crackers? Anyway, all good. Do, 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 do. So it won't matter that I've got these in different places because we won't. We'll just we'll say it doesn't matter, <laughs> just because we'll all just agree. We'll all just sign up to this agreement that no one will ever talk with these these things um i mean i guess i could just leave the molding not around the ladder that might be a neater way of doing it these moldings are such a pain sometimes when i switch around size i can make them work but not always yeah, I feel like sometimes I just pick them up and they they work, and then the next time I'll just pick them up the exact same piece and it won't work. I don't know. I'm gonna try just leaving the bit where the uh, where the ladder is as a gap. So I should be able to put one in there still. I'm just do like that. And we'll just leave that little gap there. I think that's probably going to be the neatest option. But we'll see. We'll have to see how it works at this end. It's, it, yeah, see, look at that. How weird is that? I haven't moving the piece at all. Green, red, green, red. And just because I'm moving my mouse up and down a little bit. What's that all about? Why? Is, why? <laughs> why? Green, red, green, red, green, red, green, red. Oh, yes, yes, green. Okay, this is weird. So it actually matters where you click them. Weirdy. 
I've never noticed that before. That's so so nuts. Okay, cool. Right, well that that's fine. We can we can make it work now. I trusted you all to never talk about it, but I think I'm just gonna make it work properly. Because I think someone would have. Uh, well, I say that after the after the the issues of upstairs and everyone moaning about the mirror, <laughs> the, the open the open door that I left for for a little bit of texture and flavour. I can't I can't be trusted. My mods anyway. My mods will be the ones that will be like. Uh, yeah, we can see that toast. Yeah, hopefully that works all the time. Because that's the problem, isn't it? Because once you start on the line, you have to then be able to make that. You have to line it up everywhere. Yeah, look, it's magic. It's a magic thing we've discovered. It tells you no, but it actually means it's fine. Reasonable moans. Maybe. Justified moans. Okay, right. So we'll use this rusty, rusty dealio. I think, that, as I said, I think the light position. Welcome back, Wes. The light position helps as well. Keeping the lights nice and low, like that. Oh. Stop. Ladder keeps grabbing me. Yeah. Okay, I'm happy with that. I was I was worried we we're gonna to have to janky around that edge. All it took was Tobe's patience to figure it out. Bing, bing, bing. Right, so we're using these. Oh no, we're not using that one, are we? I'm loving the sliders. I know you're loving the sliders as well. Crackers. But they are super epic. Oh, I've just done the same one again. I don't I really understand the logic of one by one and 15 centimeters. For me, 15 is a bigger number than one. So I read that as. I always read that as uh, that this one's going to be the smaller piece. Yeah, I've been good, Crackers. I've been good. Busy, busy. Always busy, busy at the moment. Yeah, I know. They're epic, aren't they? Totally epic. So there isn't... Unfortunately, there isn't like a, uh, a proper slider for these. They're just the tiles, so you have to do this. Why am I, why am I, I need to move them because they probably won't line up. What do we all think about the floor? Are we all right with the floor? I think it's okay. I think, it, I think it's probably the best we can do. I'm wondering if we need, especially on this straight wall, maybe we put some mold around the top as well. So we had the reveal of our um, our retro house competition at the beginning as well. See, so it's a uh, seventies one, seventies house, which was Lisa. Lisa and Lyserg, so they are the champions. Yeah, I think the floor's all right. Do, do, do. So if this comes out well, this might be a candidate for a, a little cheeky stop motion DD. Yeah, works well. The metal grating piece might work in places, but I think the cement is pretty perfect. 
yeah i think some of those i think some of that detail so like the vents and stuff is going to really it's going to really help land it in here so let's have a look vent oh we could actually even use this does that make sense does that make sense? I mean, I guess you would need some sort of air conditioning, right? Does that? Oh, that's actually an in-game thing. That's a base game thing. I don't think I've ever seen that before. I probably have, just never used it. Um. Oh, no. My brain shouldn't do these things. My brain shouldn't do these things. There's no way I can put that on the floor. I was thinking like a nice little sh line there, but I can't. I can't do it to myself. We've been here before. I think it came with. Fu oh right, yeah, you're right. It did come with Cyberpunk. We used it, didn't we? So we want loads of vents and grates and stuff. It's interesting, isn't it? So I can place this vent on that piece, but I can't place it on these tiles. Interesting. What can I do about the floor then? I can use... I'm not really a big fan of that though. That's the only problem. Uh, where does that now live? Is it an occasional? Where's all the survival stuff now? Where did that get moved to? Um, it's not going to be in there, is it? Oh, there it is, survival. Hey, Sebastian. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I didn't. I forgot. Because it used to be in a different... That survival stuff used to be in a different place, didn't it, altogether. So I'm not going to be able to do that. I can do that. Okay. Yeah, I, I think it's just... Habit crackers, to be honest. Force of, force of getting used to it all in one place. I feel like I'd only just started to learn everything was in the in the old way. And now everything's different. I think this looks cool. I think this looks cool, guys. I don't know what it is, but the lights, having the lights down low, definitely help. Um, so we could do some of these. I guess we kind of need to do some of these. I just wish they were smaller. Because what I want is like a like a little run of them. I guess we could do. We could kind of do. Maybe we'll make this whole front area on like a grate. Yeah, maybe I could. Yeah. I did try that before though, didn't I? I think it works all right there though. I think it works all right there. Yeah, the problem is, Mama Bear, is getting them onto the floor. <laughs> That's the problem. There's no vents, I don't think, unless I'm wrong, that place on the floor, are there? Because I think I actually know the or maybe there are. I think I know the I think I've got those. Are they Yeah, I think there are. I'm talking rubbish. I have used those, in fact, in this very house. What do they call though? Um are they drain? Great. There we go. 
Yeah, I was thinking a different thing. These are, these are a little tiny, though. <laughs> these are a little tiny. But maybe like a whole... What are you saying? At zero hour, even a toilet seat will be unnecessary luxury. Thanks for that. Thanks for your contribution. <laughs> Thanks for your valued contribution. Well, I have one when you can have 20. They overlap there. They are tiny. What about down, like running along here? Potentially. Maybe like a big thing at the bottom. I don't know. They don't quite look right, do they? They're a little bit too high gloss as well. For our janky underdwelling. Ah, oh, you think you can't blaze them, but you can't. Oh, you can't. Oh, no. One more, one more, yes. They're too, they're too good because they're inconspicuous. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll sit with them for a minute. Sometimes, sometimes when you, sometimes when you add the other stuff with those sorts of things, when you kind of fill out the context this because this is what i really want that i want that on the floor but i'll be buggered if i'm trying to knock that onto the floor a million times because i'd have to get them because what i want is a strip of them like that not just one so getting one onto the floor is obviously easy but getting 20 onto the floor or 10, however many it's going to be, is, and getting them lining up is not what I want to do today. So can we do this, like, at the foot of the ladder? Magic, magic, using the magical moving of the mouse to place it, everything's possible? No, not so much. I want that to sit at the bottom of that. Um, do we, can we put a lintel above this? Ah. Oh. Hey, Snow Duck, how you doing? Good to see you, buddy. Um, has been a while, not seen you for a while. So this can't attach to, oh, I, I guess I could just put it there. Eh. 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 Get where I want you to go. Get in there. I don't think it's going to go through, is it? Give it a whack with a brush. It's fine. That's fine. That works there. Um, What are we doing here? I guess we've got to continue round. Hope you're well, Snow Duck. We are working on the bunkery bunker place. It's our it's our little shelter world. Oh, I needed a corner piece there. Crap. I haven't played House Flipper since I stopped watching you. Sometimes things just need a break though, don't they? Sometimes you just got a bit of a break from the game. That's all right. Sometimes I take breaks from games and I come back and really, really enjoy them more than I did. Uh, and I think I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying how 
much I'm playing House Zipper at the moment. Like, not too much. I think I've gone through periods where I got a bit bored of it. Uh, but yeah, playing, just kind of playing once a week when you guys are watching is kind of, I don't know, I just, I really enjoy it now. Now I need to go through like 30,000 things to get from the workshop. I know, we just were doing that earlier. There's so many cool things. There are so many cool things. And like really clever, really clever stuff. Taking a house of a break till the luxury DLC comes out. I don't believe you. <laughs> I don't believe you. I'll give you a week. Luxury DLC comes out at the end of May. That's ages away. I'll give you a week. I'll see you back on there. Um, right. So. That bit's that done. Oh. It's a shame about this arch. That's my only my only wrangle at the moment. Then they keep checking the date. What do you mean? I haven't played since I did the 70s. I've been watching subsistence videos on YouTube trying to pick up tips. Yeah, I've seen you been on that. Cracker sucked you in on that one, didn't you? Okay, I may need to start playing that way too pretty soon. You should give it a go, Crackers. I think you'd be good at it. I definitely think you should good, be good at it. I'm sure that most people that are watching me here will be watching you, so. Changing the date, I see. Has anyone played the Tenants Free Trial? I have played the Tenants Closed Beta, which they've been updating for a while. Um, yeah, I'm not, I mean, give it a go. I'm not, still not overly convinced it's for me. To be honest, I watched a bit of Mrs. T Rex playing it last night, and what they've added just doesn't doesn't really make it fun. It's too much grind. It's grind and no, like it's basically for me. You can't make stuff look pretty. If you can't make stuff look pretty, it's not for me. It's not to say it's not a good game and that you wouldn't enjoy it, but the payoff is still limited. To be honest. She certainly did. Addicted now. Um, what are we put in here? We're going to put the generator in here, weren't we? Can look at what that looks like. I'm terrible at multi multitasking, so still not not sure about it. Well, I've been streaming for however long now, and I'm still pretty terrible at <laughs> most of the times my stream. In fact, it's not too bad. I'd say out of probably one out of one out of three, I end up with something not quite working as I want it to work. But then I fiddle with it quite a lot, so. <clears throat> yeah, me too, it's too much work. You're talking about tenants. Um, I haven't been back to look at tenants since the beginning. Been meaning to. People, watch, people watching sure seem to be interested. Yeah, I mean, I think it'll be for some, for some, yeah, but, and I can see why, I can see why some people might enjoy it, but I just, I couldn't, I, it just feels grindy to me, it just feels too grindy. Um, right, what can we put in this bit here then? I guess we could just put, I don't know. Really? I was trying to get a snack from the top shelf in my cabinet and I'm short so I have to climb my counter but I, I just fell in my sink and now I'm stuck. Oh dear, that sounds awful. You can't be that stuck. I mean, what, are you stuck in a we need to send help type stuck? Or what have you put your foot in the plug hole or something? That's not good. How are you stuck? 
Are you like a spider? Are you actually a spider? You can't get out. You've slipped. You're too, the, the edges are too slippy. You can't be that stuck because you're still <laughs> you're still in the stream. Give us some sort of sign to know, Dark. Is this an SOS situation? Do we need to call someone? No, I'm out now. All right, cool. <laughs> it's all right. Quite is averted. No need to rescue the snow duck. Um, okay, right. We'll carry them down this way. Building a toilet ladder. Yeah, brilliant. I fashioned a <laughs> fashioned a ladder. You fashioned a rope by winding bits of toilet roll together. He didn't say he was in the toilet. It's in the kitchen sink, wasn't it? Did I? Yeah. I thought it was the kitchen sink. Yeah, because he's trying to get a, a snack. Fell in back first. Oh, dear. Cracker's going to be just playing one, one day and then restart. Oh, was this subsistence? Yeah, I haven't, I haven't seen any of it, actually, to be honest. I thought you might be tempted by Valheim crackers. I thought you might be drawn in on that one. Uh, hey, Red Zet Zetro. Uh, I've caught your past highlights and found them super fun and interesting. I was so happy to find that you, you was live. Cool. Well, welcome, welcome. Yeah, we do usually stream... Things have changed a little bit in the last couple of weeks, my, but my regular stream day is today. So yeah, if you're catching me today, I'll be live again next week at the same time. And the week after, and the week after, and the week after, and forever. We are currently working on the old, old man's bunker. We're making it into a proper, like, fallout shelter sort of thing. You're wet now. <laughs> you said you were you said you were short, but now I'm thinking you're like a borrower. You're like a tiny person, and you've fallen into like. Are you actually a duck? Are you actually a duck? Are you duck size, and the you, the sink was full of water, and now you're paddling around in the sink, <laughs> desperately needing to be rescued. We'll get this one. Then we'll get this one done. You watch. We'll get this one done. This stream. We'll be. We'll, we'll blitz it. Um. So we actually need this cladding everywhere, don't we? On every gosh darn diddly darn wall. Yeah, and definitely blocking up the other exit. I don't know if you've seen these crackers, but you can place the ceiling tiles. If you notice, I've hidden the. I've hidden the floor. I've hidden the hole. <laughs> so we have a, we don't have to look at the ugly hole there anymore. It'd be cool if I could just put a little black gap there, but but yes, definitely hiding the other hatchway behind this door was a, was behind this wall was a good idea. Because I just get that extra bit of surface, and I don't have to have the other ladder. It obviously makes it slightly smaller because I've bricked in the bricked in the wall, uh, bricked in the ladder, but that's all right. Oh, I don't want that to happen. But yeah, you should definitely give the streaming a go, Crackers. It's um takes a bit of getting used to, obviously. But I don't think you'll have any problem with with Gabin for, <laughs> with, for Gab, with Gabin for, for for the whole time. If you could, you basically just got to be able to talk crap. I'm not saying anything, but I think you've already got that skill. I think you've got the skill to fill to fill time and not really and just be talking to yourself quite happily. <laughs> not being rude, really. I think you have. I think you'll be a natural at it. Yeah, well it's the bigger tile. The big the big ones. I can't actually select them, but 
I don't think I can get out of it now, to be fair, but the big, the whatever the biggest ones are, the one by ones, not the 15, um, not, the, not the little tiddlers. These ones, because then you get the bit of overlap, so you can just kind of hide it over the top. I was quite surprised it worked as well, but. These are awesome. I haven't used these. I really haven't used these for, for much before, other than the mirrored tiles stuff. But I'm going to be using these. I think I'm just going to use these in everything now. Because the white is so much better. Everybody's everybody's been raving about WandaVision. I haven't watched it yet. I'm not massively a Marvel person, though. I have to say, he's from the Marvel world, isn't he? I find Paul Bettany a little bit annoying as well. I think it's because he's married to Jennifer Connelly and I always had a thing for Jennifer Connelly. So it's just mostly jealousy. How do you, how do you, de oh, you can delete them. Do they work outside where you can't get rid of the siding? What do you mean? I'm not sure what you mean. But yeah, people been my brother's been watching them. My brothers have been watching WandaVision. You know when like you get that thing when someone's watching something and you're not watching it. You're always a bit like, mm -hmm. I'm, not in the, I'm not in the club. <laughs> I, can't, I can't talk about this. I don't have nothing to say. They're all like, oh yeah, have you seen the light? I'm like, I don't have anything to contribute to this conversation. I like the look of it, but it's on Disney Plus and we don't subscribe to... to yeah, I don't have it either. I didn't actually realise it was on Disney Plus. Not sure I'm explaining it where you can't paint. And you're gonna need to give me a bit more, I think. I'm, I'm a bit slow. Hey Western, how you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Inside, yeah. They, I don't think they work outside. I don't. I don't think that's what. I'm not sure that's what Greckers is saying though. I don't, can't put it over the. I can. <laughs> no way. <laughs> you're kidding me. I can literally just. No freaking way. Hang on, what? Hang on, what? I can just place these down in the world. Can I can I can I delete them? I can delete them. Oh no. Why does my brain I now I'm like, let's make a new world. <laughs> let's climb up. Hang on. Um, scaffold, scaffold. We need to climb up. This will confuse people. Imagine this is a screenshot and make a whole different sky. Dennis, you need to make a sky, a, a, a sky tile, dude. Make a sky tile. Oh my god, I'm so excited! I can't even type. Yeah, big. <laughs> it's this, yeah, but no, you could make a Mars, you could make a Martian, you could make it have, you could give us a, <laughs> you could give us two suns, you could give us a, a, an asteroid falling from the sky. Surely. Oh, we can't place it up there though. Oh no. Okay, my plan was foiled. I've not heard of WandaVision. I'm, I'm ultra cool. I'm ultra not cool. I don't think it's. I don't think it's by the by, to be honest, Crackers. I think it's. Um, I always think one of those things if you like. If you just keep on pushing past cool, you'll find a new. You'll find a new cool. Cool is a. Is a new. Is a. 
indeterminate boundary. What if we make it a more? Oh, what if we make it a mirror? Why are we axing toves? Oh, I kind of wish they could go up really high. That would be cool. I mean, that would be kind of epic. Armageddon tiles, exactly. Um, ceiling, ceiling. Uh, so we could do mirrors. We could do what's that? Pink. Oh, that's supposed to be pink. Ceiling blue tile. That's too much. Well, there's gr there are glass blocks. There are glass blocks now. I think someone's actually made. Oh, and in fact, there are glass panels like this. So you could make a you could make a great uh, greenhouse. You could make you can definitely make a conservatory as well if you wanted to. All the ideas. This is what I mean. Like the workshop just gives you all these new ideas, like glass blocks. We made a glass, a glass block walls in the um, now eighties retro house. What's that one? A glass block. Oh, well, that's different. That's the same, but same, same, but different. Um, right, am I losing my, I'm losing my brain, aren't I? Ceiling. I just wanted to see what it looked like. So mi mirror. Oh, these aren't really mirrored, are they? They're just, they're just shiny. Anyway, that, that's kind of cool. The only other thing I was wondering, can you build on top of those? Because that is a that is basically I think I think we may well be building a house soon, guys. I think we may well do that. So I was thinking about it earlier. I was like, the next stream, maybe we should just try and build a house. Oh sorry, not the next stream, but whenever we finish this. Oh, can I not jump on that? Maison, Maison on the moon, nice. So that ceiling tile, does it work on the underside of the covered porch? Well, that's what you were actually asking. Hold on. I've got to finish my brain fart first. So that's going up there. I just want to see if I can put stuff on top of this. If I can build on top of this. Doesn't that look badass as well? I have a 5.75 meter height for height ceiling. All oh, right, well, on the workshop already, yeah, because this is the normal one is a 2.8 or something, isn't it? Let's just see if I can put a wall piece on top of this. Um, that'll do. Can't. It doesn't doesn't let me. Try to put slabs on it to create a floor. No, it's not it's not see the height is different as well it's like floating above it let's just try one more let's just try one more wall piece because some of those walls are different there's like a different set we still might be able to do it using these what about this oh i actually fall through it i didn't stand on that you could still do this though that's Oh, yeah, but how do you put furniture and stuff on the next floor? Let's see that then. Let's try that. So I can stand I can stand on top of this. 2.75 is the height of the normal one, okay. Um, let's just get like a chair or something. Chair? Thanks. Hmm. 
Hmm. What about a rug? Sometimes rugs work because rugs sometimes create a floor and you can put something on top of a rug. But no. It might just be that this is set up to have... I don't think that's actually even... No, it's not. It's floating above. Well, yeah, we're going to give it a go. When we finish this house, Red, I'm, I'm definitely going to give it a go again. Because I think, I feel like I have, well, I definitely have better pieces than I did when I last did it. I know, I'm determined to get something to work, but it's not going to. Oh, sorry, Crackers. Right, let's actually check your, what you asked me about <laughs> 10 minutes ago when I went out there doofing about. So you're asking, can I, can I box this in? I think that's what you're asking. And then we'll just use the C, the, the, this one. Yeah, it looks like I can. Potentially. Let's try with a white one. Yeah. Okay, Dennis. Yeah. So if if it's, if, if, if it's possible to set one with a that we can play stuff on it um then that would work i think because then we could we could definitely we could so it would work because i could just use this so not this piece but the the, the one that's actually bigger and then so imagine the whole wall is stacked out of these pieces this is this is still seems like a lot of work but trust me it's not as much work as what i had to do before so imagine i mean it'd have to have another little bit on top of it but imagine then the ceiling tiles on top of that the trouble is getting it all because these are different mods my game's just frozen for a second Getting them all to talk to each other sometimes is a little bit tricky because the heights are somewhat different. But I think it's doable. Um, I'm going to check again, Crackers, because I don't think it... I'm not sure it was off. <clears throat> oh, it's a little low, isn't it? Unfortunately, you're right. Yeah, it's quite a lot though. That's a shame. It's again, it's the ceiling height, isn't it? Because the actual ceiling height is there. And that's higher than the ceiling height. <clears throat> um, yeah, it would be pretty cool. I think it's doable. I mean, I've done it to an extent before, and I could have done it. I think we could do it better now. I will give it. I think we'll give it a go. Um, once we've done this house, and maybe we'll just do it for a stream and see how we get on, and if it feels like it's worth progressing. It doesn't personally doesn't feel doesn't feel like to me at the moment that it's going to be as grindy as it was before. Um, I feel like people have done some stuff already to make it work. Where's my... What am I doing? What am I doing? Floor tiles. So we got rid of that, didn't we? So people have done like, um, like log cabin pieces now as well. There's like a a build set for a log cabin in the workshop, I think. Because so I think I've got some of it. Cabin. Well, that's cabinets. Log. Yeah, look. See this. See that? I mean, it's not the nicest of textures, but... Uh, 
think that could be pretty fun. Like you could you could do a thing out of that. And that is actually, that is transparent as well, I think. Yeah. Oh, no, it's not. It's just reflective. With all the wall pieces and windows, it seems a lot more doable. And now with the ceiling tiles, even better. Yeah, that was the thing. The only problem I've had, I have tried it. We'll see how we get on in the next, when we, when we try this properly. But you know when you stack things up in like, you know how we used to make walls out of boxes and stuff, crackers? You know, sometimes when you just like, you just touch something and it all goes wobbly or it all goes wonky, like one thing will just jank it out of place. That's the one thing I'm worried about because they don't lock together. They are all kind of, they're all kind of a little bit precarious. Although, although some of these things seem like they're pretty... It used to be a lot more fragile that some things just used to end up being like you'd spend ages. I remember making like a half wall out of the little tiny cardboard boxes and having to do it like three times for a video because it just and, and somehow placed something down or I... Oh, it's when you sell stuff, isn't it? Sometimes when you sell stuff, it just like disrupts a load of other things. Yeah, have to lock the hammer away. <laughs> yeah, very true. <clears throat> okay, so we're doing... The sauna pieces were bad for that. Yeah, they were. I did hit a little snag out in here, but we can probably hide that away with something. So let's do the rest of this floor, or I forget. But yeah, it seems it seems plausible. I mean, it was such a pain to do that. Do it before. Anyone that's seen those videos is, you know, they're four minutes long. That's like probably a, I don't know, I can't remember how long it was. A long time, <laughs> a long time. I don't probably even want to admit how long it actually took. Seems much more achievable. The thing is, you don't what you don't want, and what I was nervous about before, is to get halfway. Is to get halfway and have it all just kind of something go wrong, and it just end up being that you have to abandon. Um, is it? But when I mean, when you're streaming, it doesn't make so much difference because, yeah, you guys are. It's a different thing. When you're doing something like that, yeah, Crackers will definitely know this. When you're experiment experimenting with an idea for a video, if it doesn't work, you 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 bin it. Like, that's it. You chuck the footage. You're done. Whereas if you're streaming and it doesn't work, well, you've, you've already streamed. Like, you guys have been part of the process. It's very different. And it's a cool, definitely a cool, a cool part of it because it, it, it kind of means, yeah, we could kind of explore stuff together in it, which is kind of cool. This is all my caveat for predicting massive failure. Just found a YouTube account named Crackers with your C, but it was backwards. Oh. It's someone pretending to be crackers, or is or is this crackers someone pretending to be a crackers? Dun, dun, dun. You need to rename your your channel crackers or your like Twitter or whatever to be the original crackers OG. I don't know what OG set actually means, but I thought I'd say it because it makes you sound like you're cool and hip. <laughs> I don't know what it means. <laughs> That's what people say. What does OG... Is it... Oh, it's Original Gangster, isn't it? I'm so old. Original Gangster. Did Never did have the patience for that. You, you had for that. Little things I don't mind, but on such a big scale, I don't know how you did it. I think I went through a... <laughs> I think I went through 
quite a lot of like podcasts and videos and snacks. Have I started buggering this up? Have I started using the Creo? No, I haven't. Why does it suddenly look like it's bigger? Does that not look like it's bigger? Did I just move it up? That's the, is that the Creo? Going mad now. I, d I really do wish there was a way of looking at what you've got already. It would be the one thing I would add. So it is the Murnum. Some sort, well, if I, if I had the choice, the features I would say would be an absolute necessity for House Flipper 2, if that ever happens, would be an undo button for sure. And some way of just like selecting something you've got and reusing it. Because it would save so much clicking in and out of the menu. Myrna wall strip. And this must be the Creo then. Other giraffe. <laughs> just subcrackers going to go through your house with the vids after the stream. Definitely do, Mama Bear. Definitely do. She is the one that inspired me to play. So, uh, 10 p.m. here, time to lay down. Say good night already. It's that time. It's one o'clock. Mm -hmm. Well, that's better, isn't it? Oh, I'm being an, an eejet. Yeah, Crackers is... I, yeah, I looked at my... I, how many videos are you up to now, Crackers, by the way? Because I looked at mine the other day. I've got, hundred. I think, 110 House Flipper videos. Well, House Flipper things. So either streams or... So you must have... You must be... Like bajillion more, like an eyedropper tool. Yeah, that would be handy, wouldn't it? Because even the paint, or even just some way of like identifying a thing, hundred and sixty-ish. Some way of like just. Yeah, I mean an eyedropper tool would be would be definitely that would be ideal. And what would be cool is if when you had it yeah, that would be the way to do it. If you when you had it in your hand, it told you what the piece was on the wall. Or whatever that you're about to pick up. Or that you're about to reuse. So you you just mouse over it with the eye so it would be one of these. An eyedrop tool. And you could look at it. And it would tell you what it is. And if you clicked, then you'd be reusing that thing. We've got to play Sims at some point. We've got to play Sims at some point soon. I think that's where we're, where we're heading. Because Paralives is not looking like it's going to be this year. So I think we'll be... Uh... I've done Murnum down bloody Creo everywhere, haven't I? Egypt's. Yeah, exactly. Some sort of duplicate thing. I mean, that is the thing. That is the single biggest thing I miss from like playing, or well, the two biggest things I miss from playing Planet Zoo are the the, the whole like undo function and the duplicate function. What's the create a style tool do then? What's that do? I haven't played Sims. I probably haven't played Sims in about 15 years. So I actually have, I have Sims 4 on my machine. Uh, I think I got it in a sale at some point and been intending to pick it up and play. To be honest, I've sort of been expecting 
I've sort of been expecting the app. Oh, I've done it again. Egypt. I've sort of been expecting the appetite for House Flipper to disappear. Maybe we don't need them. Maybe we don't need that. I don't think we need that. Let's not do that. We're going to do something different. Are we? Mm, I don't know. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I will keep it as it was. So I'm making a city in Minecraft survival. Make a Minecraft survival mode. And so far I've spent 1300 hours on it. Yikes. Sorry, this is probably infuriating, guys. Create a style that lets you play with custom patterns on furniture and just about any surface. Cool. So does it let you... As in, like, add your own sort of thing? Sounds cool either way. Oh, I said I wasn't putting doors on here, didn't I? I wonder what happens if you use a moulding underneath one of those arches. Guess we'll find out in a second. No, it doesn't work. That's what I was expecting. Can I can I get the little blue bit though? Can I have the little blue bit? As much as I like the workshop, I also kind of miss trying to come up for a workaround with what we didn't have. Yeah, I I I kind of see that as well. A little bit of me kind of feels that as well. Because I think sometimes, like, yeah, I kind of have that feeling as well sometimes. I think that's our arc that's our arc days, crackers. That's our like you know, coming up with some workaround creative way of doing things. And now you can just get the bit to an extent. I think it makes it harder to be I think it to, to an extent it makes it harder to be unique content wise it makes it harder you know all those like especially things like making a bar you know there's just a bar now there's just a bar set on someone's made a bar and, and all that sort of thing the restaurant sets all of those sorts of things will all just be there and it's not it's now not quite as easy to be as to sort of demonstrate creativity but i think it just makes it different we've just got to get used to it it just makes it a different thing. And certainly for, for me, I I want to spend less time doing the grind. Like it, it makes it more, it definitely makes, it, this fits more to, um, I don't know. I mean, I, I suppose we're still, you know, it's, it's just a different type of, of finding a creative way to make stuff. Yeah, I think uh, that's was kind of my. Take it kind of takes it away from me, but yeah, it was stuff I was crying about and wish I I don't know <laughs> exactly the same. We just complain whatever we've got, right? It's the nature of it's the nature of humans. I mean, I guess that's why people do. Um, I mean, I think uh, I was going to say that's why people do like on Sims, they do videos that are tagged with like no CC. There will always be an appetite for it because there's a, there's a 
console community. So if you wanted to make stuff that we just never never used anything from the workshop, there'd still be an appetite for that because there's plenty of people that are playing it on um, on console. But it's just whether that stays interesting. Just for me, it just kind of there's only a certain number of there's always only a certain number of things you could make. Touch myself in subsistence instead. Goodness me, this is a moldathon. Molding moldathon. This is going to be a bit grindy, guys, unfortunately, but all of this is ne necessary. I've had this in for a while saying I was going to give it a go and relearn the game, but I haven't yet. Yeah, I mean, I I have no interest in the actual Sims bit of it. <laughs> I could take that. I could just, like, none of that. I could be bothered with. None of the tamagotchi this of it I can be bothered with at all. But I'm assuming none of that is this is like something you have to do anymore. Are you going to move up your your lower slider to fill the gap toads? Which one am I missing, Lisa? What am I missing? I'm not sure about this bit coming around the corner. I think that's probably not going to... I think I'm going to take those out. So I can't close this little gap in, unfortunately. These are not these are not so forgiving in terms of the overlap because of the pattern and they'll get a Z fight. So I just have to put something over that to hide it. I'm going to do the... I'm going to have to do the... Uh, the rusty this rusty deal everywhere um, under window I think we were using no so this is a perfect example of where like having an eye drop at all like what was that called dark blue there we go. Oh, that's not it. Was it? Bl I think it actually said it was black, didn't it? Heritage. Yeah, there we go. Oh, if I put that down, I needed to not put that down. Yeah, thanks, Crackers. As I said, guys, if you haven't already subbed as Crackers, Go do so. Recommend playing The Sims 3 first before The Sims 4. Gameplay is so different from each other. It is insanely. It is insane. It, each other. It, Sims 4 is drag and drop with swatches. The Sims 3 is all editable and adjustable. Yeah, I've heard some people say that before. Oh, we've got to go back the other way. What are there lots of people still playing Sims 3 though? That's would be my problem. Is whether there's an audience for Sims 3 content. Obviously that's not applicable to all of you, but but yeah, that would be my thing. Do 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 Um I don't like the guns. I know some people like the guns, but I don't feel like the guns have a place in this game. I don't really understand why they had to be in here. Oh, we don't have that. We've got lights in here already. I mean, it's it's a renovation game. Why are there guns in here? I would quite like to see them do some actual more renovation-y things. 
Like, give us the give us the ability to be able to make offices and stuff. Because that opens up a whole different net set of things that you can have. Like trunking and all that sort of stuff. HVACs and all that, you know, much more kind of industrial y things. Um bugs me that when we that we can't turn them like like they are when you first come into a bunker this are they side were they sideways yeah i didn't even really re register that so as soon as i pick it up it i didn't even really register that that's annoying isn't it like that's just so annoying don't give it to us like that if we can't use it like that About thirty-three percent of the Sims community still play it. So good, a good way to check that sort of thing. And what I tend to do is, if I'm trying to decide on whether a game is going to be like, sometimes a game, an old game, can still be worth playing in terms of you know making videos and whatever. Uh, a good way I quite often check is just to like look at the number of people playing it on Twitch right now. Or look at the number of people streaming it, sorry, and the number of people viewing it. And if you see like a reasonable number of different people streaming it, and you see a reasonable number of different people watching it, then it's a then it's a decent one to sort of go. But yeah, for most people, if it's just that you want to play it. Uh, sorry, I'm a hardcore Sims fan. I know every inch from it, from its lore to every feature mod and cheat. Fair enough. Yeah, I mean, I, I would probably have to kind of go down the Sims 4 route, I would say. Because my... They're not making content for it either, are they? Sims 3, presumably. Does that look like it's... My favourite is Sims Two. Oh. Yeah, I've heard. I've heard that um, they took a load of features out. The Sims Three fifty one viewers on Twitch, and are they all viewing one person? I mean, fifty one viewers is says enough to be honest. So there, there was probably if you look at how, how many people are watching House Vipper right now. Not that many, but there'll probably be a hundred or come a hundred, I would think. 4.9. See, that's the thing. And then the, the next thing is to look at if most of those people are watching one. So if four, if it's 4.9, but you know, 4.5 of them are watching one stream, that's a little bit of a misleading stat because they're just watching the person. They're not watching the... It's not necessarily the game that's carrying that. You know, if Shroud plays House Flipper, suddenly House Flipper looks like it's got thousands and thousands of people playing it. Nineteen. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, that's the thing. Unfortunately, that is a thing that. Yeah, I mean, I guess that will probably... There'll be a bit of a jump. <laughs> Thank you, Razzle. Thank you, Razzle. Razzle's like... Don't don't forget to like as well, peeps. There's 14 people watching at the moment here. So we've got more... We've almost got more people here than the whole of everybody on Twitch playing this game. But yeah, there's a lot, quite a lot of people still watch these, uh, still watch the videos of these. So we're making that the bathroom, we said, didn't we? Do, do, do. 
we said we're making this so what did we say did i say i was knocking this together i was talking about knocking this together wasn't i i think i'm gonna knock it together guys Mr. Arcado on Twitch plays House, House Fibber and has 3.7 thousand followers. Um, yeah, but it doesn't play House Fibber every day, does he? Probably. Yeah, we're taking this wall down. If it wasn't for my, if it wasn't for it being my first bunker. I want this to look as good as it can be, and it needs this wall to go. We've done it. We've already done it. Committed. <laughs> Sorry, Lisa. We'll we'll go back to the plans on next on the next time. I just would rather it look as good as I think it can look, and it's not gonna if it's. Two separate rooms. But yes, they are my rules. Um Yeah, it, it it will get it will get more popular again when you know the next DLC comes. gonna have a problem there am I why is that happened then okay I've just moved the problem down the wall fair enough we'll keep it in that corner then yeah because I can make this this like a living room what I'll do with this is this is like just a big so it'll be a living room, kitchen and bedroom, all in one room, storeroom, toilet, and then that bit up there. This bit will probably have some tools and stuff in it, I think. We'll put like a shelf, maybe a, like a work workbench. I, well, I don't think I have, because I think I'll be able to see it. Oh, he says, I have, it's there. The egg spike. Let's see if we get we can iron it out. Might just be pushing the bomb back down the other side. Yeah, I mean I mean there's nothing against the game at all, because as you all know, I love it. But yeah, you know, it's I don't I can't actually remember how old it is now, but it's quite old. Like it's done well for what it is. They've done well to keep it kind of ticking along. I don't think the tenants is going to be anything near a patch on this game, unfortunately for them. I cannot I cannot see how people would be playing the tenants sort of you know four years after it's come out it's not sandboxy enough that's my thing everything I play is sandboxy because you make it yeah you, you make the gameplay last as, as long as you want with your imagination this the tenants doesn't have that It's a very different it's a very different type of game obviously but and i'm not saying it wouldn't be fun and it wouldn't be it could be successful for them and i would love it to be but um yeah i don't think it's for me unfortunately if you're commenting about the walls dennis you're a little bit behind my friend and we've already done it yeah it's a shame it's a shame that isn't it Lindsay 
I wanted to like it, but I I feel like and I I sort of I gave some feedback about did I actually give some feedback? And oh, no, I don't think I actually did in the end. Hey bunny, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, I just don't I don't think it I think the concept of what they were going for was never really gonna appeal that much to me. I've just bought I don't need to do that. Get that one. In fact I don't even need to paint this at all because I'm I'm doing my, th my thing over here. So we are doing a bunker thing deal. Trying to make it look like it's a, a shelter a fallout shelter oh, that's what it's missing it's missing the curves isn't it i don't have the curves yet um but what was that called i think it was an oz thing i think it was one of mr ozke's doodlers that thing I'm always intrigued as to as to pe how people come up with their names. Is that directed at at Bunny? I think a lot of people just use their names, don't they? Maybe not. I'm saying that it's probably not true at all. I think it's it's um. Yeah, you do get a lot of random. That is definitely one of the that's one of the stream challenges. It's, it's just is to like, is to quickly interpret a string of characters that don't actually look like a word. But you're like, what does this person? I mean, most of most of the you guys have all, but we do get quite a few in in the Twitch stream that are just like I'm like look at them just be. Am I overlapping them? But yeah, sometimes I just look at look at the names. I'm like, um, I don't know what you want this to be. I'm gonna call you whatever. They're all good. So that side's all done. So this shouldn't have a curve to it. It should only be the exterior walls that have got a curve to them. Is that, am I actually getting that, is that down? Is that, that looks like it's got a gap there. Why has that got a gap there? Oh, that's what I wanted. Oh, is that what you meant by overlapping them? Yeah, I was doing that the whole time. I've done that on the others, I think. Do, do, do. Is Bunny Tutu? Well, that's a good name by itself. Uh, okay, we'll finish this off with here. Yeah, it's a shame they've done that. With the, I'd, well, I'd never noticed that they were the wrong way around, but. I guess it doesn't really matter. But it, yeah, it's a bit funny that they decided, <laughs> whoever was making this level decided, oh, they look better that way around. Doesn't matter that they could never do that. Right, so curved all the way down there, curved all the way down there. Definitely adds something, doesn't it? Having that little shape to it. Oh, I'm getting uncomfortable in my chair. <sighs> Sorry, guys, I'm moving the microphone around for a minute. If you can, if hopefully that's not donking too much. Okay, so. Yeah, definitely. That's definitely going to be better. That's 
as one big room. Um, so let's fix these bits up. I've done everything. I've done all the sliding. I can't decide whether I'm doing... Oh, I can't do that anyway. They have to stay like that. And do I leave them... Do I go like that? Or do I leave them like that? It definitely doesn't look as good, does it, the arch, with the fact that it's... That it's got that white bit. Has this person made arches in different colours, does anyone know? Is there like a grey version? Because that would be poor effect. Oh, that's a good idea, Lindsay. That's a good idea. Yes. I mean it doesn't it doesn't change the fact that we can't change the colour of it. But it does mean I can put that down. Good thinking about that. Does it go into that corner as well? Hmm. That might be a problem. Oh, it's fine. Yes, Lindsay, good work. Perfect. That definitely helps. In fact, actually, that's a little bit more interesting a shape as well, isn't it? Because it's a little bit more like crookedy. My Bluetooth headphones decided to error 404 on me. Weird, they just stopped communicating with my phone. But my phone said connected. Who thought removing the 3.5? I know. Yeah. That was controversial when they did that, wasn't it? Because that 3.5 universal, universal, whatever it was. A universal thing. One of those cynical capitalist decisions. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it does look better, doesn't it? That definitely helped. Just neatens it up a bit. Sometimes it's just the little details. The little details that just make it just make it a little bit more satisfied, I think. Just a little bit of neatness. Yeah, I think so as well, Razzle. Gives it a little bit more janky, doesn't it? Just that little bit more kind of jankiness to it. A little bit rougher. I realise this has been a lot of uh, a lot of moulding and a lot of cladding, peeps. So I appreciate your patience. I think it's coming together. I think it's coming together. I think the next stream is pretty much going to be making it all look pretty. Love the use of the arches on ceiling. Pretty neat. Idea, got to give it a try. Thank you, Merza. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, that's a good idea, isn't it? Well, it it does it does um it does it, it it makes sense for a basement anyway, or it makes sense for what we're doing bunker wise. It just makes it feel a little bit more claustrophobic in here, which is what I wanted. Oh, 
I wonder if it... Oh, does this mean I'm going to be able to use the rusty tile bit as well in the archways? I think maybe it does. No, I don't want that. Uh, right, so have we done... Oh, we've got one more to do. Yeah, that's... I mean, that's definitely one of the virtues of the stream. Yeah, it's collective collective brains sometimes really does help so we're gonna have a door on this because this is going to be the bathroom so i don't need to do that uh oh, hold on let's just finish these might as well put the little bits on while we're here um no, I shouldn't, because I won't know the level. I won't I won't quite know the position, so let's just get those in place first. Not the Creo, the Murnum. The other I've got another bunker in my brain as well. So there's a guy that I watch, I don't know if he's made anything for a while. Um he is what's his name colin furs colin furs youtube channel he's an english guy i think he's a yorkshireman um and he's got he basically just got his youtube channel is all about making random stuff uh and so he's made like flamethrowers and and like jet powered trikes and and all sorts of things and he's got he one of his most successful videos is how he lives in like maybe it's not yorkshire actually i think maybe it's not at all um he lives in like a normal house he's got i think he's got he may well i think he's got millions of subscribers lives in a really car that he dug into the garden and it's like a normal looking kind of house on a colby sack but it's got this enormous great big bunker that he dug in the garden uh phones don't need to be waterproof like who's showering with their iphone x some sort of electronic attraction that was the argument wasn't the wasn't it for them taking away the the whatever it is the 3.5 mil jack and it made them waterproof well they hadn't really ever been a problem before so it was just so they yeah I don't, didn't do it for that reason hey Jamila 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 Alawi welcome welcome hey by the made your name butchered your name too much yes sorry i should have said that as well but i'm assuming that's probably a hello <laughs> i'm assuming that's probably a hello but yeah if you can if you can try or if, if that's if that's all you probably maybe if you don't understand me if you're not if you don't understand what i'm saying i don't know but you're welcome god i sound like such a pig ignorant englishman i'm one of those people that i really wish i could just wouldn't it be nice to have like a universal translator i'm not doing this i've just remembered i'm not doing that uh Modify the colour of a workshop. Easiest thing to do in Unity. Yeah, I started doing it. I was my brain was on a on a guff. Having a guff moment. Um that I think actually in here looks alright lightwise. I don't mind them being the other way round. I want them a bit lower though. I think that guy's called Colin. Yeah, Colin Furs. That's what I said. 
He built a full size bunker under his lawn with a with a shed for his entrance. He uploaded it eleven months ago. Spot on. He's done all sorts of cool things. He's made all kinds of cool things in his garden. And it's all like um it's all like soundproofed and stuff down there. So he's got he's he's got a drum kit and so he plays his drum. Basically it's just a massive great big uh boys toy type deal. So I'm not overlapping these here for some reason, but it doesn't really matter because there's a wall in the way. Because they don't look now like they're too low. But yes, that is that the picture of that bunker or what that bunker looks like is another inspiration picture that I've got in my brain. This back room, I want to look like that. So it's going to be it's going to be a little bit more glam, I think. Oh, that's not right. No, 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 no. So what what are you then? What are you all about? Oh, it's right. That's weird. We don't need two sets of switches now. Okay. Yes, this feels much better. I'm much happier with this big room. I wish I could get rid of these though. I really do. Do I think we if we like bash them with a hammer? Flame them with a flamethrower? Toves. Uh, this is definitely a bad idea in an enclosed space. <gasps> I bought. Oh, why it's behind me? How is that happening when it's behind me? I want to get rid of the drains. I don't like the drains. Careful! I failed to be careful. The gaming PC's hard drive is dead, so I'm stuck with the Xbox version, and it's so far behind. It's stupid. Yeah, it's not. That's not good, is it? No, 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 no. I know. I should. I should have known better. <laughs> I should have known better. <laughs> tut tut. Um, we're not using the Creo. We're using the Murnum. The mouldings, you mean? Red. The mouldings are. You cannot. You cannot. I cannot do a room without mouldings now it's probably the least exciting bit of the streams but it does make it does make such a difference rooms look so much better but that being said i have played for many 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 hours without them before we got them on on pc Oh, I didn't do that for a reason. Corner. It's been a lot of moulding in this one, hasn't there, so far? Why are you doing that, then? That's because there's a little doodler there. Got to, sometimes you've got to be careful you've got rid of all your little doodlers. Otherwise that little doodlers will get in your way. Right. Is that all of it? That's all of it, all of it, all of it. There's a door going in here. That's done like that. Maybe this is different. I think this is different in here. Okay, right. So, storeroom we said main room so these things um maybe just one of those and we'll ditch the other one in fact let's ditch that one uh yeah and we'll get some of these going 
I wonder if we can drop stuff on top of that. We probably can. Shelf. The bed is going to go in the main room, yeah. It's going to be an all, all, all main everything in there. All the things. Oh, can I stand on you? Yeah. 13 peeps, 13 likes. Whoop whoop. Next to the cooker. All of the things, all of the things. Don't you worry, it's all going to be fine. Oh, uh, my little shelf thing is not working. It needs to be a proper shelf. I don't need an electric blanket. <laughs> Shush, you naysayers. You wait. You wait and see. Do we have fire extinguishers? I think we've got fire extinguishers in the base game, didn't we? Might be wrong. All of this just to put a box up here. I want them to add flowing lighting options so light stays on in another in other rooms. I don't have it on Xbox for performance issues. I say add it. It's our responsibility to look after our Xboxes. Can you turn it? So do you have like a settings? panel though do you have the like options to switch some of because we've because that's a setting isn't it pc that's a setting uh is there like a workbench i'd like a workbench should we have a quick look on the workshop let's have a quick look yeah, that that um that option is is that eco lighting system. But I'm guessing you don't have that setting on on console. I guess that's what you're saying. Let's have a quick look on the workshop. See if there's a workshop a uh, on the workshop. If there's a work bench, um, let's just get it open a second. Um, what am I doing? Why can't I get to the Steam page? There we go. Okay, right. Work bench. Aha. This is cool. This is going to be massive, though, I bet. As long as Dave doesn't leave a kitchen cupboard door open, it will be all good. Yeah, well, we don't have the option to keep lights on in unoccupied rooms. That's the setting I just showed you. Eco, 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 whatever lighting setting. But yeah, it sounds like you're saying that option isn't there. Um. And an extinguisher. You don't think we've got an extinguisher? Ex extinguisher? Like that? Is that right? That doesn't look right, does it? Is it just extinguisher? It is. Someone's already thought of all the things. Right, is there anything else we need while we're in here? I don't think there is. Is there anything else? What else do we need? We've got a cooker, we've got a washing machine, we've got all the stuff and things. Maybe a sofa. Is there any nice sofas now? Is there any new nice sofas? Hmm. Not really what I want. Okay. Okay, 
back. Um, okay, right. I reckon that bench is going to be huge. Uh, it looked kind of massive. Work. Please be small, please be small, please be small. Oh, it's big. It's it's a big old it's a big old beast. I could have tried couch, couldn't I? This looks like it's gonna be Oh, it's kinda of cool though. Huh. We don't have space for it. I likes it though. I likes it very much. That's a shame. What about the other bit that came with it? It's just a, just a little unit, isn't it? There's that. I guess I could use that. That doesn't seem... That's not really what I want, though. That's like a garage thing. It might have been... Um, it might not be their decision though. Sometimes those decisions get forced on them by the uh, Xbox or by Microsoft or whoever. I don't know. What can we use then? What can we use here? I guess we could just use a... I don't really want to use a table. Bench. So there's a there's a bench vice, but no but no bench. I just want I kinda want a little workshoppy bit. I kinda wanted it here to be fair. To be sure. To be sure. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So, yeah, that small table is what I was thinking of, the wooden one. Mm, uh, enormous wooden table. Hey, Zoo Boy, ninety one. Welcome, welcome. How you doing? What are we looking at? That one. That one's probably the best bet, isn't it? Oh, it's a shame it's got that little... Maybe we can hide that away. We can probably hide that little decorative corner away in the back there. What do we feel about these as well? I think these can just go. They're not going to serve any purpose here. But maybe along the corridor. They're just a bit a bit pointless aren't they down here I don't need to take a bath thanks <laughs> thanks you randos what are you on about no one asked you if you want to take a bath weirdos Why isn't there any furniture here? What did I just put down? That's a bit big, isn't it? Um, I wonder if there's like a tall thing, like a nice tall thing on the workshop, like a, the, the back plate thing. What is the news about this house? The news. Half the press. This Taves is stuck on the ladder. Oh. The news is we've made a lot of moulding. Uh, we've done many, many stuff and things with moulding and cladding and bits and pieces. We still have many more stuff and things to do. 
And once stuff and things are finished, the house is finished because we've done everything else. It's just this, it's just this down here, dude. Now, um, is there? Oh, there are tools, aren't there? There's a bunch of tool things. Where's the actual? Oh, there's a section for tools now. Um, I don't know. I don't know why I'm feeling like tools is appropriate to have down here, but it feels like it is. I want them on the wall, though, really. What am I going to use to hide that? Chainsaw? Seems a bit odd, doesn't it, to have a chainsaw? Chainsaw sitting down here. A drill. We're getting there though. It definitely looks better with the brown thing. So the brown needs to come through the rest. But I think I'm just going to finish these two little archways. And then that's going to be it for this one. Until the same time next week. I don't know what I feel about the bits being white. They definitely look better, but would they be better off white? Probably yes. Um, and does anyone remember what these were called? Oh, I can't remember what they're called now. Textured? Text textured? Yes, score. Mm, 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 mm. Oh no. So is that underneath? That is underneath. Um, is this the whistle song? Is this the whistle song? If this is the whistle song, I'm going to go nuts. It is the whistle song, isn't it? Oh, man. I don't even know if this is the one anymore. I'm so confused. I've skipped it. I don't know if that's even the one. I'm confused though. But good spot if that's the one that I've got a problem with. I feel like I've removed it from the playlist though. How is it still playing the damn thing? So if you don't know, I've got... Oh, it's really annoying, but I've got like a copyright issue with a piece of music that... That piece of music, if it was that one. Which I shouldn't have a copyright issue with it because I paid for the damn thing. Uh, but some scumbag is trying to claim monetization on like all of my videos. Not heard it for ages, not been on Twitch. Oh crap. I don't see how that could be different though. Good spot though, yeah. I was just happily whistling away. It might be that one. You might be right. But it's on like, well, it'll be on this one as well now, but it was on like seven videos at the moment. That I'm not getting any revenue from. Someone else is trying to nick it. Um, okay, let's just do, we'll just finish the, we'll finish the ceiling tile. I'm a bit worried about that jinkiness there. Does it matter? Because this is all going to be that same. Yeah, I can't understand how that could possibly be. I feel like I've removed the... I thought I'd actually removed the track, to be fair. Do you think that it's been on... Could it have been on Twitch and you just not heard it? 
because I don't I don't think there's any difference in the playlists. Oh well, it is what it is. Yeah, I don't, I'm not sure now. I can't actually remember. I'll check it after the stream. Uh, oh, there we go. Because it used to be this, it used to be the track that I had at the beginning of every stream. Yeah, I think maybe you must, I think you might be right. What's really confusing and what why it's really a, 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 a slightly tricky one is that the track as far as my like the track that I downloaded is not the track that they've it, I mean it's the, the the same track that they're claiming is theirs but it's not called the same thing it's really confusing it's called something else uh so when i downloaded it it's that track is called something like good morning sunshine or something like that um but when they claimed it they claimed it called something else and either way they don't have any legitimacy to claim it because I've paid for the track but I think I said this a while ago unfortunately it's easier to make a bogus claim than it is to dispute a claim I'm not sure about this now oh, why am I making that That should be grey, shouldn't it? I've done that grey. Anyway, right, we'll leave that. I'll just I'll put the white tiles up here and then we'll end the stream. Uh we got two stream Thursday back tomorrow. Um so we will be Planet Zoo in. That's not what I want to do. Planet Zoo in on Twitch in the daytime um, from 2 p.m. UK time. I think I said 2 p.m. I think so. And then we are doing Little Nightmares DLCs in the evening times from 8 p.m. Which, if you haven't seen those before, they are much, much fun. There's loads of things cool. There's loads of cool things coming up actually. We've got um, Fruit Strike Kingdom starting next week, so we are. It's all a little bit confusing, but it does seem like they're basically saying uh, that it's not. It's not going to be a closed alpha, so anybody who's got alpha access can make content. So I will be making content like a crazy thing on that from next Friday. Right, I think, oh, I might as well just finish that little bit there. Oh, you gonad. Never mind. Well, oh, that's going to really annoy me if that's the case with that track. There's, the trouble is a lot of the tracks that I've got, I mean, they're, they're background music, right? So they, they're not that different. But I have a I have a sneaking suspicion that you might be right. Yeah, I saw the little gnome dudes. There's like it. I think we're a little boy as well. It's, it's not your fault, Lindsay. Obviously, it's me for being a doofus that I've just deleted the track. I feel like I have deleted the track. But obviously, haven't. 
thing is I didn't want to delete it in case I needed to like make a point and say this is what the track is called and I have it on my computer and I've had it on my computer because of this I don't know I'm sure it'll be fine it'll all work out in the end we'll all sort it out right so we'll call that done for now obviously we have lots to do on this still next week so yeah bathroom storeroom living room bedroom all the stuffy things well yeah but that would be most the music Russell. <laughs> that'd be most the music that would be most of the things like even this one's got whistling in it I've just got to do a better job of making sure I've got rid of it. May and maybe we caught that quickly enough. I don't know. Probably not. Anyway, right. Thank you very much for watching, peeps. We are very close to um, we're very close to something. I'll look and see if I can find some sort of tool things for that as well. Uh, I think this is going to be cool. I'm looking forward to this room because I've got pictures in my head of what this room can look like. It's going to be small and tight and janky, but I kind of want it to be. Anyway, right. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you're watching this after the fact, don't forget to like uh, and comment and all that sort of stuff. If there's stuff that you've got ideas on you want to contribute, don't forget you can do that in the, in the comments and stuff. And I shall catch you guys on the next one. Take it easy.